What's up guys? So today we're doing episode 15 of Reading Your Guys' Jeeps where we just kind of take a look at everyone's Jeep and kind of give my thoughts and opinions on it and just kind of show off everyone's Jeep. All right, so we got Ryan here first. Hey Kyle, I love, I like your Comanche and figured you might like to see another one. Of course, I always like to see more Comanches. This is my 89 Comanche Pioneer. Originally was a 4 liter Rinex, AW4 column shift automatic tool drive blue interior. After a bit, okay, a lot of work. It's now four-wheel drive, uh, high output swap, very nice, AW4, uh, NP231 uh, transfer case, Dana 3035 for now, gray interior mods. Got uh, the four liters, <clears throat> excuse me, four liter swap out of a 93XJ, very cool. Headliner, custom grind comp cams, that probably sounds cool. 99 intake, triple electronic fans, three row aluminum radiator, uh, four and a half inch lift from zone. Very cool, 32s. All right, power window lock swap. Keyless entry remote start, nice. Sound deadening throughout the cabin. Future plans, bumpers, headache rack, <laughs> and more lights. <clears throat> All right, let's take a look. Very nice, like the color. Oh, also, I think this is the Cherokee that it, the motor came out of. Very cool, very nice, get your son. Into Jeeps, I like it. Oh wow, very cool. Love the wheel and tire setup, that looks super cool. Very nice looking Comanche. Nicely done too, looks looks really nice. Yeah, those are a really neat wheel actually on the truck. Kind of makes it look a little bit more modern. I like it. Very cool, things I would change, I don't think I'd really change anything on it. I think it looks nice, you did all the things that I kind of want to do to my Comanche. Uh, definitely a four liter would be sweet. But very cool. Thanks for sending your Jeep in, man. I appreciate it. All right, let's go to Sam here. Hi, Kyle. I'm a big fan. Love what you got going on. Keep it up. Well, thank you, sir. Here's my 99 Sahara. Bought it from a guy bone stock with 110,000. Went ahead and bought some 33s. Very cool. Painted the wheels myself. Went through and refinished the frame underneath. Started making changes. Most recent being metal cloaks. Uh, here is where it sits currently. Hard top is on for winter. Curious, curious as to where you might take it or your thoughts. Uh, keep up the great work. Well, thanks, dude. Let's take a look here. Very nice. We got a white Sahara. Very cool. Nice. Love the metal cloaks. Those look fantastic. You did a nice job painting your wheels. Very cool. I love the, the bead lock. On the side there that looks cool very cool so things I would change on the Jeep not a whole lot um I love your wheels and tires that looks fantastic I like that a lot and the metal cloaks look great uh, one thing I would recommend doing is painting the little bolts on for the metal cloak uh, you know this side access panel um, I painted mine black I think it looks a little bit better kind of more blended in but uh, I love the interior on the Saharas. They look, I love the tan and the green. It looks cool. But uh, yeah, you already blacked out your trim rings and your headlights. You got LEDs. I think finishing off with the rear metal cloaks would definitely look super cool as well. And then maybe some type of tire carrier setup. Um, so you're not putting a ton of weight on your rear door back there. But uh, yeah, I really like it. It looks super cool. And then I would maybe get the uh, original um, Sahara. This is the Sahara sticker for the newer TJs, the 03 and up. I would get the old school one. I think they'd look a little bit cooler. Um, so I would get a, that sticker. Um, but other than that, I really like the way the Jeep looks. Maybe some rock guards. It looks like maybe there were rock guards on here at one point. Looks like there's a bunch of holes here. Maybe get some rock guards that would look kind of cool. But other than that, the Jeep looks really cool. I like it. Thanks for sending it in, bro. All right, we got Henry. Hi, Kyle, my name is Henry. I love your channel and wanted to say keep up the great content. Thank you, sir. I love getting home and watching the new uploads. You are one of my very, one of the very few YouTubers I love to watch and enjoy. Well, thank you. I admire your Jeep. I have a 98 Wrangler 4 liter Sport and love it to death. I bought it completely stock, but here is here, here is my little list so far. Uh, Rough Country Shocks. A coils two inch lift mickey thompson baja claw 33s now i wish for 35s nice pro comp 15 inch steel wheels can't go wrong with that 
light bar and pods, fishbowl and stubby front bumper, rough country 9,800 pound winch, uh, EAG rear bumper with jerry cans. Take a look. Very cool. Love the wheels and tires. That looks fantastic. LEDs are cool. I that actually looks pretty neat. Different style than what I have, but that looks cool. Love the stubby front bumper. That looks super cool. Your half doors are cool, like the netting half doors. I like that. Very nice. Pulling some dirt bikes. I like that a lot. Very cool looking tires. I don't think I've really ever seen those. They're really aggressive looking. That's cool. Color of the Jeep is, is neat as well. I like that. Jerry can mounts. That looks super cool. Tire carrier setup looks great. Yeah, really clean looking Jeep, man. Um, things I would change. I always tell people to pull the side steps off. So I'd probably pull the side steps off, kind of give it a little bit cleaner look. But other than that, I you did a really nice job. Really classy looking Jeep. I like it a lot. Very cool. Well, thanks for sending it in, bro. All right, we got Seth here. Take a look. My dad and I picked this up a couple years ago with 90,000 miles. It's a stick shift 33s and of course the four liter. I'm hoping to get a winch this fall. Thanks, Kyle. Seth. Very cool. Take a gander. Nice. Silver is a great color for a Wrangler. Really cool scenery wherever you're at. That's awesome. Very cool. So uh, things I would change. Definitely pull off the side step for sure. That's what I would do. Um, like your bumper, that looks cool. The red accents look neat, I like that. Headlight, headlamps are great. Um, I can't really tell if these are still chrome. Yeah, it looks like your trim rings around your headlights are still chrome. I would paint that black, that would look really neat. And then lastly, the only thing I would probably do is either, um, you know, when you do get a different set of wheels and tires, if you ever do, um, either have them spaced out farther for these flares or get some um, shorter flares so your Jeep's not so like tucked underneath your tires aren't so tucked under your Jeep I think it would look better with maybe just like a stock um, size flare I think that would look a little bit cooler so other than that I like the color um, I would do black wheels that's just me but uh, other than that the Jeep looks really clean so thanks for sending it in bro all right we got Casey Hi Kyle, I sent in the Blue Rhino line Jeep a while back since then I sold it and bought a new one. This is an 014 4 liter and I think it's this one turned out a little better. It's just sad there's no trails to keep. Trails for keeping in Rhode Island. Thanks for looking, bro. Any ideas? Welcome. Very cool. All right, let's take a look. Yellow, I like it. Love the wheels and tires. That looks great. Very cool. Front bumper looks cool. LEDs look fantastic. I like how everyone's doing the, the sun pies. They're a great um, headlight. Um, they look super cool and they're really uh, inexpensive. So, But the wheels and tires look great. Um, I like the, the rock guard here. It's kind of like integrated. I like the look of that. Looks cool though. I mean, just a set of wheels and tires on a Jeep make uh, the Jeep look, look really good. And you already did the LEDs. So I think it looks pretty good. So uh, thanks for sending me your Jeep, bro. All right, we got Tanner here. Hey, Kyle. What's up, Kyle? My name's Tanner. This is my 2017 JK. When I got her, she had a light bar set up and some light pods. Since then, I've uh, added LED headlamps, fog, fog lights, rock guards, LED taillights, third brake light, CB radio, rear bumper, and tire carrier, 33s. Uh, new wheels. Uh, next will be new bumper and some new fenders. Let's take a look. We don't see too many JKs. Very nice. Red, great color. Nice. Definitely much better than stock. Got some little bit bigger tires on there. Very cool. I like your light bar up top. Headlamps look great. Tire carrier looks nice. I like that. That looks very cool. Nice LED tail lights. Very cool. I like it. So things I would change. Uh, my buddy did this on his JK where you basically buy these like end caps for the bumper. Like if you don't want to spend a whole lot of money on a new bumper uh, basically just chop off uh, these ends of the bumper and then you put these caps on and uh, I would recommend bedlining and all then that way it's all kind of one color but uh, I think that would look really good on this kind of give it a little bit more of like a stubby look up front it kind of makes the tires and everything look a little bit wider 
Oh, that'd be cool. I like your rock guards. That looks cool. But uh, other than that, that's that's probably the only thing I'd really do. Either that or get a new style front bumper. But if you want to save some money, you can just do those caps that go on the end there. That looks kind of neat. But uh, other than that, Jeep looks great. Oh, very cool. Thanks for sending it in, man. Of Hannes? I don't know. I probably butchered your name. Sorry about that. Hey, Kyle. Love your channel. Well, thank you. Uh, rate my Jeep 2006 Wrangler Rubicon, 3.5 inch Rubicon Express Lift with 33s. Water brand new. Very cool. Sending the photos from Armenia. Very cool. Well, sorry about messing up your name, but that's cool. You got a Jeep out there. Very nice. I like the red stitching on the steering wheel. That's cool. Very cool. Love the jerry can setup. That looks cool. Roof rack looks really cool. I like the ladder on the side. I like your flares. Those look really cool. Very nice. The limb rises look great. Snorkel. Hey, you really did it up. Love the front bumper. Uh, it's like a, almost looks like stock, but a little bit uh, more aggressive looking. I like that a lot. LED headlamps look great. Yeah, super cool looking Jeep. I like it. I'm not a huge fan of the mud flaps, but maybe you have to have those in your country or something like that. But I think it would look a little bit better without those. But uh, other than that, the Jeep looks really cool. Really like it. So black Rubicon. The wheels look great. Your tires are really nice. But uh, I like your rock guard setup you got up here. That's cool as well. But overall, really nice looking Jeep. Very cool. Thanks for sending it in, bro. I appreciate it. And sorry, sorry about butchering your name. <laughs> All right, we'll do one more. We got Jedi Knight here. Bit of a work in progress. It's an 05 TJ. It has the four liter, very nice. A four inch lift kit, no rust, low mileage. Currently uh, getting bigger tires. Also bought it with custom decals. All right, let's take a look. Nice, we got two pictures here. Wheels and tires aren't too bad. Definitely could use some bigger, bigger wheels and tires for sure. Um, things I would do, um, pull these bumper caps off, uh, kind of gives the Jeep a little bit more of like a stubby look. I like that in the front bumper. Um, I'd probably pull off all these little graphic things on there if it was mine. Um, definitely pull off the sidestep there for sure. Get some LEDs that would really uh, look nice and then black out these trim rings. And it looks like your fender's a little bit faded. I would either paint those or you can buy like some plastic restoration stuff, but you could just paint those, either bedline them uh, or something along those lines that would kind of really um, bring some life back into them for sure. And then uh, same thing with here, either you could pull these off or you could just bedline these. On Project 4 Banger, I bedlined all the plastic and it looks really, it kind of really makes it look brand new again. Um, but other than that, it's a good start. I love the half doors on the red TJ. That looks great. I like that a lot. Um, but yeah, just couple simple little things and it really uh, kind of make the Jeep look a little bit uh, a little bit better so but very cool thanks for sending it in bro alrighty that's gonna do it for this episode episode 15 so um, if you guys want to send in your Jeep uh, shoot me an e email info.kylesvt at gmail.com with the subject rate my Jeep and uh, we'll hopefully eventually get yours obviously you can see we got a bunch more to go um, but anyways, hopefully you enjoyed the video. If you did, give the video a thumbs up. Definitely consider subscribing. That helps me out a bunch, guys. And we'll see you guys in the next video.